Okay. Okay, I just had to take a couple of pictures for Instagram to put on my story and let these niggas know that I am streaming today. Alright y'all, today's episode of Sam and a Story Time! Let's boot up, see him. So let's boot it up. Let's boot it up. Let's boot it up. Oh, Jesus. You can't see nothing. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I had my camera turned off last stream because I was looking for old But Don't forget to like, follow, subscribe, comment, all of that. Submit a story. Discord, Instagram, link down below. Follow me on Twitch for a regular screen. The name of this Sims in a story time is going to be called Roller Skates. Dogs and crushes. The day everything went wrong. Bitch. <laughs> this is so dramatic and for what? Mine's disabled. Alright, y'all. Sims and a story time. Roller skates, dogs, and crushes. The day everything went wrong. Dun dun dun. It was a scorching summer day when me and my sister were visiting our grandmother's house. Now our grandmother lived in a neighborhood filled with kids and we were always having a blast hanging out with them. But there was this one kid who caught my sister's eye, Matthew, and let me tell you, she had the biggest crush on him. Okay, period. So we got three characters. We got the the person who sent in the story, we got their sister, and we got Matthew. Alright. Every time we visited, my sister would go out of her way to catch Matthew's attention. She'd dress up, take long walks around the neighborhood, you name it. But one day things took a turn for the unexpected. Why are her titties so big? She's a teen. Like, she, she doesn't need any titties or any butt. She's a kid. She's a kid. Um, I don't know. I know some kids are built like that, but I just feel like that's a little weird. I want them to be like sisters who kind of look alike, but don't look alike. And I like the way her lips look. Can Sims have braces? If she can't have braces, she's going to have some fucked up teenager teeth. I always say this, but every time I'm playing Sims, I'm always like, this looks like somebody that I know. And let me tell you, she had the biggest crush on him. Every time we visited my grandmother's house, my sister would go out of her way to try to catch Matthew's attention. She'd dress up, take long walks around the neighborhood, you name it. But one day, things took a turn for the unexpected. Oh, um, child. Uh, where's the clothes? We were strolling through a neighborhood, chatting away when we spotted two fluffy white dogs. Am I able to make dogs in this program? Cute. I like it. I like it. And then she's the younger sister. The way she was talking made it seem like she was the little sister. So I'm going to give her little sister vibes, but not too much. Strolling the neighborhood, chatting away, when we spotted two fluffy white dogs in front of Matthew's house. Now, we were dog lovers. Okay, period. Shout out to dog lovers. So, we didn't think that much of it at first. But little did we know, these dogs were about to turn our day upside down. As we approached the dogs, they started growling and barking at us. Girl, no, what? As we approached, the dogs started growling and barking at us. Our sister, ever the optimist, thought she could play the hero and return the dogs to Matthew, meaning winning his admiration in the process. But as you can imagine, that didn't go according to plan. So now we are going to make Matthew. My sister in her infinite wisdom was wearing low roller skates because why not? <gasps> Wait, what? Was she wearing roller skates? Is there a mod for roller skates? 
She thought she could impress Matthew with her skating skills, but now she was regretting that decision as we were being chased by his ferocious dogs. <laughs> ferocious is kind of crazy. Like, sorry babes, but I just feel like you're being just a little bit dramatic. Trying to save the situation, my sister took off her roller skates and scooped me on my back and made a match dash to safety. That was a mouthful. <laughs> we were scratched, shaken, but thankfully we managed to escape without any serious injuries. Okay, so the dogs didn't eat their asses up, which was good. <laughs> My grandma wanted to march over to Matthew's house. Oh shoot, grandma is a part of the story too. I knew they said that they were at grandma's house, but I didn't know grandma was a part of the story. We gotta make like grandma. Do y'all see what grandma is wearing? Why do grandma got all this outfit? Oh, bestie. Why do grandma got all this outfit? Granny got them gold in the mouth. Got them gold in the mouth. Got them gold in the mouth. <laughs> my grandma wanted to march over to Matthew's house and give them a piece of her mind but my sister insisted she insisted that everything was fine of course she did she didn't want to get Matthew in trouble after all she didn't want to get Matthew in trouble see called it <laughs> called it what did I just say she didn't want to get Matthew in trouble despite his lack of sympathy for what we've been through uh-uh uh-uh you telling me that y'all went through all of that and matthew he didn't even care he didn't even say oh i'm sorry my lovely pookie dookie ladies i hate that y'all been through that like he still ain't giving you no attention he still paid you the dust that's crazy and as if the whole ordeal wasn't enough, Matthew's indifference to our near-death experience was the final nail in the coffin for my sister's crush. Okay. <laughs> near-death experience is a bit of a stretch, I think. Don't y'all agree? Near-death experience, that's a bit much. But I'm not saying that my grandma would not wear this outfit. I'm saying what I'm, what I'm saying is let me let me clarify. I'm not saying my grandma would not wear this outfit, but she would not wear this color. No ma'am. No ma'am. Matthew's indifference to our near death experience was the final nail in the coffin for my sister's crush. But hey, at least we got a wild story out of it, right? So, what is she saying? Is she saying, like, is she saying that her sister still had a crush on Matthew? Or is she saying that her sister didn't like Matthew anymore? Or, I don't, I don't understand. I don't get it. Okay, and this is everybody. This is everybody. And that, my friend, is the day that roller skates, dogs, and teenage crushes collided. <laughs> More of the story. Sometimes it's just better to stay home and watch Netflix. <laughs> They're cute. I like it. I like it. I like it. I think they turned out amazing. I think they turned out cool. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's the story y'all i think it was cute i think it was a cute story just a bunch of little girls being silly and goofy been there done that probably have done worse unfortunately have probably did worse um but i think it was cute more of the story ladies love yourself it's never too young or too old to start loving yourself like stop doing all of that for a guy and then also why i didn't ask the person who sent in the story but why don't you have no roller skates on because really we talking about your sister but your sister would have had to go through what she went through carrying your big back ass on her back if you had your own roller skates so bestie 
you in the wrong too anyway y'all if you like this video like this video if you don't like this video don't dislike this video just comment down below what i can do differently again this is sims 4 and story time if you have a story that you would like to submit go ahead and add me on discord my server is linked down below and you can submit me a story or you can dm me on instagram or i don't know you can put it in the comments and i'll just tell the story i i don't i don't know how she would do it other than discord and instagram i don't know check out my other videos if you like me gaming and want to see more authentic unscripted natural gaming content make sure you follow me on twitch um i don't know what else to i don't know what else to say so i guess i'll say bye 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 see you later see you later see you later